Hi guys, hi everyone. Okay, here we are still in Luang Prabang and I wanted to do a little vlog about where to eat. In Luang Prabang there are hundreds, literally hundreds of restaurants and my wife and I have toured around them trying lots of different varieties of restaurants and this one was recommended to us a few days ago and we came here and we were absolutely amazed. It's called the Indigo House uh, Roof Terrace Restaurant. And at first, when I looked at it, I thought, okay, this is gonna be an expensive restaurant. But in fact, it's one of the cheapest restaurants in the whole of Luan Prabang. And the food they serve is unbelievable. It's really good. Now we've all been to restaurants in the past where uh, you pick up the menu and you choose your meal and what you actually get is nothing to what the photographs on the menu look like. I think McDonald's and Burger King are the classic examples of that. This place is actually different. What you see on the menu, you actually get on your plate. Now if I can, I've got a couple of photographs I'm going to put onto this blog just to uh, show that. So I'm going to give a little bit of a, a pause in my commentary here. And hopefully that will be the point where I've put a couple of photos up of the food. Actually real photos, not, not nothing, you know, photos I took. Now what is interesting also about this place is this rooftop restaurant this rooftop terrace there's no lift so if you've got a disability problem or mobility problem then this is not for you but then you can always go downstairs they've got ramps here so it's easy to get up to but upstairs is the rooftop terrace it costs exactly the same and the views are stunning so where is this place okay the indigo is at the very beginning of the night market street now this is the I know there's so many people walking around at the moment. This is the beginning of the Night Market Street and it starts here and goes all the way down there for about half a kilometre. And this is the only four-storey building on the Night Market Street, so you really can't miss it. So whichever end you start from, look for a four-storey building and that's it. Trust me guys, it's a damn good restaurant for a great price.